Hello learners, welcome to the video. In the former video, we came to know about the revolution of Earth. The movement of the Earth around the Sun in an elliptical orbit is called revolution. So, learners, tell me the difference between rotation and revolution now. Well, yes, rotation is the movement of Earth about its axis and revolution is the movement of planets around the Sun. Now, if you observe keenly, you would see different effects due to rotation. There are many effects due to the rotation of the Earth. First, days and nights happen on Earth. Second, half of the Earth always gets illuminated and the other half remains dark. And third, at the circle of illumination, dusk and dawn occur. Fourth, Due to the rotation, the ocean and winds deflect after crossing the equator. Let us explain these effects. Days and nights are because of the Earth rotating about its axis and not its orbit around the Sun. Okay learners, have you ever thought about what a day or a night actually means? Okay, don't worry, I'll explain. The part of the Earth which receives sunlight is the day and the part of the Earth which is in shadow because it does not receive the light of the sun is night. So, what have we learned by the occurrence of days and nights? Well, it means that every portion of the Earth that faces the sun is receiving sunlight and the other opposite portion is in darkness. It is the circle that divides the earth into dark and lit halves. That is, it is because of this circle that we obtain different parts of the day and night. The illumination circle gradually changes from the east to the west. Now learners, these are some more effects produced by earth's rotation. It is because of this rotation a force on all objects is produced. So let us learn how it affects oceans and wind. As our Earth's shape is spheroid, thus the force extended by rotation is greatest at the poles and least at the equator. Thus deflect ocean currents and also cause waves. There are five major ocean currents. The North Atlantic, South Atlantic, North Pacific, South Pacific and Indian Ocean. Due to Earth's rotation, the air which keeps circulating is deflected towards the right side in case of the Northern Hemisphere, while in the case of the Southern Hemisphere, it gets deflected to the left. Now it is time to explore. Can you think what is the cause of day and night formation? In this video, we have learned the various effects on Earth due to rotation. Some of them are day and night formation, ocean currents and winds get deflected, etc. In the next video, we will learn about the effects of revolution. I'll take your leave. Till then, bye, stay happy.